Guys, Wondershare Filmora has added so many AI features that have made it one of the best and complete video editing software. These all features were really demanded and will make your video much and more attractive. In fact, these are the reasons where Filmora is destroying the CapCut. And few of the examples are Planner Motion Tracking Audio Visualizer AI Mask Amazing stock media like the background video AI video enhancer and many more things. So without any further delay, let's quickly get started. So let's start with the planner motion tracking. So I can take any clip here in the Filmora. I will drag to the timeline, choose the resolution. So now if I play the clip, so you can see that I have a video here where I can put any kind of text or any kind of object. So in order to apply the changes, select the video. Then from the right hand side under the video, you will find the AI tools. Click on it. I'll scroll down and you will find the planner tracking option here. Just enable it, click on auto and now you will find this kind of frame which you have to adjust that where exactly you want to place the text or the object. So you can drag it according to the size where you want to add or place the text and this is perfect. Alright now I will click on the start so that it can start detecting the planner tracking. And it may take a while depending that how long video you have. Alright, so once it's been done, now you can select the object or text whichever you want to. I can take it from the sticker here within the Filmora. And I can take this subscribe button and I will drag it on the top of the video and make sure that it matches the size of the video. Once you are done, again click on the video. Then again come to the AI tool on the right hand side. And in the planet tracking, you will find the link element. Click on the drop down and choose that particular text or object. Once you are done, now if I play the video here, so you can see that how smoothly it works without getting disturbed. And this object, this video can be anything wherever you want to add any kind of text or add any kind of images or any kind of pictures. And now next we have the audio visualizer. This is another amazing feature and the demanding feature that many video editors have been waiting for this feature. Now it's been released within the Filmora only. So I have my audio here and then from the left hand side only you will have to click on the effect. And then from the left hand side under the audio effect you will find the audio visual. You need to click on it and these are the visualizer that you can choose. And the best part is this will be working according to your audio. Let me show you some example here. Personally, I like this one audio visualizer circle zero one. So I will take it. So let's take the more example here and I will take this one. This also works perfectly fine and you will find that if I stop it, it automatically stop and if I reduce the sound of the audio, it will stop working. Let me show you. And if I increase the sound. Amazing. So this way you can add any kind of audio visualizer that have been given in the Filmora now. Whichever you need, just try it and use it. Okay, and now let's move to the next feature that is the AI mask that works absolutely perfect now. Let me show you. So here I have a picture and if you want to drag any picture here, you want to mask. So very easy. What you will have to do, select the picture. Then from the right hand side under the image, you have to go to the mask section. And here you'll find the new option AI mask. Simply click on it. Now whichever part you want to select, simply just drag it. You don't have to be too professional here. Simply click it and see bingo how amazing it works. It has successfully uh, masked the image that you want to. Now let me mask the right side lady. Bingo. See how amazing and how fast it works. Even you can use the manual masking that is being given on the right hand side only and you can adjust it. In case if it doesn't mask automatically perfectly, then you can also use the, some kind of adjustment. And now next we have the amazing stock media like the background video. Another amazing feature because most of the video editor, they need some kind of background uh, video effect depending that what kind of video editing they are making. Let me quickly show you. 
So from the left hand side, if you click on the stock media, now here under the library, you find different kind of sections. You can go with the trending one. And if I click on it, I have few of them here. Then you have the solid color motion background. So that's another amazing in the motion background. You will find a few of these popular one and this paper one that is another uh, useful and the trending one you might have seen in many videos people using these kind of video background then you have the technology so you can choose any of the technology or video here whichever you want to like this one or this one probably whichever you like you can browse you can also take the social media one then we have the cinematic and let me show you a few of them that are really very really trending and I'm very sure you might have seen in many videos. So this is the first one. Then we have this one. Even you can use them as your background video or background wallpaper, whichever you want to. Then we have this popular one. And these are really useful and especially for the people who are do video editing without showing their face. And not only this, you can get many other kind of things that you have to search like the countdown. You have few kind of countdown here, the cinematic countdown. Then you get many kind of subscribe option. You can get many kind of intros option that you can use from here only. Uh, according to the category wise, as I said, you can go in the game section as well. And you get many kind of clip here like this one. And you can see that how clear it is. And this way you can use different kind of clip depending that what is your use and within the film mode only you can enjoy all these clips and the background uh, videos. Now let me also show you that how exactly it works if you use it for the background video. So let's say if I take this paper one and then you can select any kind of element, any kind of image or any kind of text like I take this one and you can see that how perfectly it looks. Now you can put any kind of animation or you can even use the keyframing that how exactly you have to move this object. So this will depend on your creativity that how exactly you use these kind of background videos. All right, now let's move with another amazing feature that is the AI video enhancer. Now many times you might have the video clip that you want to use, but they are not in the good quality. No worries. Now within the Filmora, you can enhance them very quickly using the AI video enhancer option. Let me show you again how exactly it works. So on my end, you can see I have a clip here that is not too clear. So what you will have to do in order to make it more clear, select the video. Then from the right hand side, click on the video section, go to the AI tool, scroll down and you will find the AI video enhancer. So you don't have to do much. Simply click on generate, then sit and relax until the processing is being completed. Alright, so bingo, so you can see the enhancement has been completed and you can find the difference here that how clear the video is now. Now, not only this, you can also enhance the voice as well within the film mode. So let's say if you have any kind of voice that you recorded, any kind of voiceover, and if you want to enhance it, you get another amazing feature of AI voice enhancer. Very simple. Here I have a clip. Hey everyone, welcome back. Crown Geek here. So creating and having a Mac OS booty. So this is a voiceover, but I'm really not satisfied and I want to enhance it so that it should look more attractive and more clear. So what you will have to do from the right hand side, you have to click on the audio section and within the audio, scroll down and you will find the AI back voice Crown enhancer. Geek. Simply toggle it on and below you will now find two different options voice clarity and the voice beautifications. Now this will all depend that what kind of voiceover, what kind of voice quality you have and accordingly you will have to adjust it. Now what basically I keep here, the voice clarity somewhere around 22 or 25 and the voice beautification yeah. around 15. So creating and having a Mac OS boot, you can find the difference USB now. can be re really useful when you want to re install or install the Mac op operating system to fix multiple problem. Bingo. So now you can see that what kind of difference we made in the voice clarity without using any other kind of third party application and everything can be done within the film mode only. So as I said, depending on your voiceover, depending on your audio, you will have to adjust the voice clarity and the voice beautification. Whatever suits you the best, listen it, observe it and just export it.
okay now let's move with another amazing feature that is the voice ai translation now within the filmora with the help of filmora you can just uh, translate your language very quickly and very professionally so for example i have a video clip here recorded by me that is in english of course so let me show you background geek here so creating and having a mac os booty so what you need to do select the clip then here in the function menu you will find an option by this icon that is ai translation and it says support translating voices and text and audio and video into multiple languages click on it then in the source language select your desired language like i'm going with english us and in the target language you have to click on the drop down and choose which language you want to translate now here for example i will go with the french one so i will simply select it and click on translate now again after clicking on translate you just have to sit and relax and you can monitor it under the task list once the work has been completed and once it will be done i will show you that how perfectly translate your language bingo so now you can see that how quickly it work now let me show you that how exactly it work let me play the video now salut tout le monde et bienvenue ici les geeks par conséquent il est très utile de créer et d'avoir un usb démarrable macos when you want to reinstall or install tout le monde est bienvenue ici les geeks par conséquent il est très utile de créer et d'avoir so isn't it really amazing because now you can just create a video in one language then you can translate into different languages and you can post into different platform so another great opportunity for the content creator and for the video editor okay now let's move with the last feature that i will be sharing with you that is the smart bgm generator that is the smart background music now whichever video clip you have now you don't have to worry about the background music simply drag your videos in the timeline let me show you i have one video here then i will take few of them from the stock media all right so once i am done now what you have to do go to the very beginning of the video then you will find an option here the smart bgm generation and it says automatically comprehend the content on the current timeline and generate suitable background music so what you have to do you need to click on it and then click on the start all right now you will see that it's analyzing the video content and according to the video according to the video content it will be creating an amazing video background music so once it will be done it says the smart bgm generation is complete now if i play the video here all right outstanding so you can see that how perfectly it choose and pick the background music depending on your video you can try your own self depending that what kind of video you have what kind of video background you want uh, you can choose it using the smart bgm feature of the filmora and that's all guys for today and hopefully now you can enjoy the filmora almost all the features are available inside it so go ahead and enjoy it the link will be in the description you can find it the code will be in the description whichever feature you want to enjoy and make sure that you hit the like subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye